You just let me know when to go and I'm a rocket. Yeah. Alright. Three, two, one. You are now in tune to I Hate Brandon Pseudo TV with your host, Brandon Pseudo. Uh, today I got something special planned for everybody here. Um, this one goes out to pretty much everybody and also everybody who thinks that uh, I probably can't rap. Well, you know, I can't. I just talk with swag because some of y'all can't. And I kind of can't conform with the whack forms. That is just not me. I'm sorry. My apology is for making you feel like you're not as hot as me. Instead of just saying you're like mulatto hair in the morning, you're just really not. A lot of y'all here in the moment might be really shocked because I'm like, I'm right here. I'm not caring what I be got under my hair. And I'm feeling like I forgot what it's like fearing a writer being a writer being and a writer being. Whoa. You might have to write that line down before you think of asking your teacher's professor what might go down if I mess around a mess around a missile round, which is what depicts my mind when I miss around and it hits your sound and you can't spit because you don't know how I don't spit. I rip the street abbreviated suffix out of spit and recite it like it's nothing but numbers. I speak wonders. Brandon slumbers. Hearing nothing but grumblers and I can tell your girl likes cucumbers. I'm having fun. It hurts. Your tongue to spit the verse. You know I just laid in a hearse. But you won't even get the hearse. You'll get the Prius I rented from Hertz. So come step to me, I treat you like step backwards in a leash, a fraction thing of what might be effort to say some whack rap thing that make y'all go back to the vocabulary of a three-year-old baby and scream. Debating is cream when I stop for a knock on the stopwatch and think what should I say to make hearsay fear say. So say fear and you will hear what my dictionary definition needs to be updated to read. I spit words Miriam Webster needs to look up because this non-varying bester isn't shook up to give Harvard a hookup and write a doctorate book of how to write lines like doctor book pictures you might find if you looked up lobotomy. This isn't even rapping. This is philosophy. I'm proud of me. Your girl says you're not as hard or as soft as me, so don't say nothing back. Just stop. Before I go like the opposite of stop and use you like stop backwards to cook somebody else because you are just pots to me. No apostrophe, but use a bunch of monotony because I just throw words. The kind of you don't even know because I make my own words. This is my world. I'm apostrophe. I'm apocalypse and catastrophe. I am crafty. See, you are cheesy like craft. I see a girl cheesing like macaroni. You were Will Ferrell running around screaming spumoni. That was a semi-pro joke for you semi-pro jokes. I'm like a demi-pro with a hemi flow, an enemy of those who don't know Jack. In fact, you need to be in boxes to meet him. My presidential decree is y'all get used to seeing this non-fictitious Riddle McFlippin', sicker than Sticky Griddle, trickety trick killer, iller than a painkiller, white as Mac Miller. I'm the whack distiller from this day. I'm fact filet and a pact made by me and me to devastate y'all fakes. I'm just playing with words now. Taking my verse down under my round head, under my crown dead verses on the tongues of young Urkels. I run circles round like I'm Hercules. And no, you cannot like my verse. You have to ask me first because I'm cocky like I'm in Boston asking a drive, I'll steal the RV out of drive away and drop that sorry for the fake because you are just asking to die away. Thank you. <laughs>